What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to check out the university, the Lore Master University. You need rank 10 Lore Master rep and a bunch of crafting stuff. I'll show you how to get all that crafting stuff. And it also costs a million gold. So it's a pretty, not not too easy house to get. But I'm going to show you how to get it and what it looks like in this video. Let's get into it. It ain't my fault. Okay, so right now I have the Lore Master Library currently equipped. This is the library. Uh, it's only got four rooms if you include the beginning room, but I like the lighting and stuff in it. It's pretty cool. Um, this second one, I think it costs like 500k gold, so you're going to need about 2 mil gold uh, to craft up to the university. University just got released this Friday. It was supposed to come out last Friday, but the art was messed up or something on it. Uh, so to get the house, you go to Librarium. Here, uh, you need the rank 10 rep, like I said before. I don't know if it shows up even if you don't have the rank 10 rep, and you need a bunch of crafting materials. You need fabric, boards, nails, and paint. Now you get, and varnish, uh, you get all this stuff in Green Guard. So the nails will be from the Black Knight. So if you know where that is, it's in Green Guard West, I think. Uh, and it's a pretty low drop chance for the nails. It took me quite a while to get 50 of them. And then when the last one, I got like, uh, like seven okay so um or 17 actually on the last drop that's why i have 57 it's they're pretty low drop rate uh the boards come from the tree in green guard east the fabric comes from the wolves uh the paint comes from the slimes and the varnish comes from spiders something it's one of the mobs in the area you'll, you'll find it just by farming them uh that's basically it that's how you get all the crafting material it's not too hard to get any of that stuff the nails will take you the longest of course and uh, once you have all that, and you gotta like farm, you gotta start with the tent, and then go to the hutch, the cottage, the library, then the then the university. So let's buy the university, and let's equip that as our house. All right, this will be my first time checking it out. Hopefully, it works. Ooh, that's cool. So our people in my house right now. Sometimes that bugs out the uh, house system. It didn't work. I probably have to change servers. I'll be right back. All right, well, this is weird. Okay, I think I figured out why it bugged out because the house that I had equipped, I merged into the new house. So, of course, it's going to bug out. Now, do I have to buy a house for this to work? I, I don't know. Let's buy the villa. Why not? Sure. Okay, that gave me a house. So, is it going to actually let me go to the house? I never ran into this bug before. Okay. Wow, I've never seen this house before. Villa is a member-only house. Okay, it's actually pretty bad. All right, well, we're not here to see this house. Uh, let's go to house, university, add item, yes. Okay. Now, let's check out this university. This took me a long time to farm. So I hope it looks good. Okay, so we got glass on the top. Ooh, okay. I'm liking it, I'm liking it. This reminds me of another house. Oh, okay, that's cool. Kind of like a, the lighting coming from the outside, kind of a courtyard. That's really sick, actually. I guess it's the library, I guess. That makes sense. <laughs> Not a big fan of that room, though. And another courtyard. That's the whole thing. That That's a million gold house you need a rank 10 rep for. Okay. Okay. So, would I recommend farming for this? No. I mean, maybe if you don't have any better options, it is non-member, so it might be a good non-member house. Uh, but compared to other houses you can get, even that brand new house in the new area that just came out uh, this Friday, the Reshaper. Uh, just for context, I'll give you the map name once I join here. Um, I think it's called Slash Join the Pilb Pilgrimage. I think that's it. Even that house, I think it's better than the new one here. So to get the new house that just came out this Friday, all you do is you run up here. And it's like 12k gold or something. So, yeah, you go shop. And, yeah, right there. Valgard House, uh, 250k gold. Uh, so, it's not too expensive. It's one-fourth the price of this house. And, in my opinion, it looks a bit better. Uh, yeah, I'll show it real quick just for the sake of the video. Um, Valgard House right there. So, this is a 250,000 uh, gold house compared to that 1 mil rank 10 house so you got your you got your view over there 
Nice windows. You got one small room, another small room, another small room with a ladder, and another view. I mean, maybe it's not that much better, but I don't know. In my opinion, I prefer this house over that university, maybe. Eh, maybe not, but for how hard it is to get, I'd, I'd use this over the university. I wouldn't go farming for that. That's my thoughts and how to get the new university rank 10 lore master rep. Not worth it. I mean, the best thing you get for rank 10 lore master, honestly, is the cape are the capes and they're not even that good with the dragon on your back and stuff like that so it's probably not worth farming that reputation maybe one day there'll be a class for lore master that would be cool uh but it's not worth getting rank 10 right now considering how hard the, how long it takes to get rank 10 uh so thanks for watching if you like the video like it subscribe if you're not ready i'll see you guys all in the next one peace